What is up my YouTube friends? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the sickest garage here on the platform. My name is B with Prey for Snow Auto Detailing and I am pumped to bring you another side-by-side. -side. Today in the garage we have a 2017 Polaris Razor S with... Hold on. I'm gonna tap the brakes really quick on this introduction because I have a question. Well, kind of a follow-up from another video. When I did the Polaris Pro Razor R, whatever, the big one a couple weeks ago or a couple months ago, it was a crazy expensive vehicle. And somebody, a friend asked me, why would somebody spend $42,000 on an off-road toy? But I think the more important question is, what is your reason that you're never gonna have any money? What is it that you spend your money on? Because I have stuff, for sure. And we'll talk about that later, but uh, I'm kind of dying to know. Comment down below. <laughs> and it has about 600 miles on it. We are going to detail the exterior and the interior, and it's going to be so much fun. I actually really like detailing these Polaris. Well, I'm not brand specific, but for right now, we'll be brand specific. I love detailing Polaris utility vehicles, so let's get to work. Most of the cleaning procedure doesn't really change with the side-by-side. -side. The only thing I don't do is the iron removal because it just, they don't have a lot of fallout and contamination on them. So I'm gonna pressure wash off. Obviously I've got what tire cleaner. I've got my IK sprayer and my PNS brake dust buster, which is, uh, it worked really well on that Polaris Razor Pro R, whatever that thing was called, that monster. So it worked really well there. So we're gonna do that same cleaning procedure. And as a total, Side note, I bought this new spraying head. Now, there's a couple of things I don't skimp on and that's typically products. However, the spray head was incredibly cheap. So cheap, in fact, that when the box showed up, the word thick, because it came with a, a foam cannon too, it was like 10 bucks on Amazon, but it came with a, a foam cannon and I can't even remember what else was in the box. Oh, different nozzles. But on the foam cannon, no lie, or the description of the foam cannon, they misspelled the word thick. They spelled it T-H-I-C-J. I thought, that's when you know you get a quality product. <laughs> have the foam cannon prepped with the auto foam from Bill Tamber. Really love the product. Really not a fan of how much it doesn't foam up. I'm going to start playing with the foam cannons a little bit. Maybe drill some things out. We'll, we'll test. I, I just want, I like the performance of it, but I just don't love how it doesn't foam like crazy. So I'm going to check. Just, I want to make sure these razors have these zipper pockets. I mean, it's an after market yeah. thing, but they have these zipper pockets. I just want to make sure that they are all zipped up. Driver's side door looks good. Just want to not get anything wet that ought not get wet. And then we will pre-wash. Bunch of sunflower seeds in there. Do these look good on me? They don't fit. Nope. Nope. Hard pass. <sighs> Ooh, that would have been bad. 
Ritz crackers and water. Let's check in the bag. Gives you wings, help me. Barkus helped me out a ton getting everything prepped. Oh, do you know what I have prepped? Slacking here. Let me find it. I didn't prep my lights. Now the garage is prepped. <laughs> now that we have everything ready, we've got the clean slate from Chemical Guys in the foam cannon, as well as in the bucket. We are going to foam cannon, hand wash, two bucket method, OV, and then we'll rinse. Actually, foam cannon one more time, then we'll rinse. <laughs> you know what a time it is, my friend. Let's go, foam cannon. Not as smooth, lame, lame. When I cleaned the last razor side by side, it had that flexi windshield, so I touched it the least amount possible. But this one has not only a folding windshield, but a folding glass windshield with a manual wiper, which is dope. So I'm not only going to wash it with the two bucket method, but I'm also going to seal the glass. Booyah. Rinse off. We're not going to iron decon, so we'll move right on to dry.
Now, I have tried a bunch of different drying methods when cleaning side-by-sides, and the hybrid method just is not the most efficient. We're only gonna use the Adams Air Cannon, which is always a blast. At least I think it is. The razor is beautifully cleaned and dry. Now we need to prep it for the protection. I'm gonna put on some gloves so my digis don't get some oil on there. And then we're going to use, I think I've got CarPro eraser. I'm pretty sure, hold up. Oh yeah. <laughs> CarPro eraser. Oh, I'm a fat lip, lame. protect all of the paint and the plastic, we're going to use a graphene ceramic spray coating from Adams Polishes in the advanced formula. It's gonna be tight. I've got some applicating pads. And then we're gonna level and wipe off with a microfiber towel. Before I get rocking on the interior here, I'm sure you're dying to know what is it, what hobby eats up all of my money. <laughs> I don't know about all of my money, but my wife and I, my beautiful wife and I work very, very hard. And one thing that we love to do is we love to go on mini adventures. So not huge vacations, though we try and do those every once in a while, but every couple of weekends or every other month or so, we love to either get in the trailer or when it's cold, we go to the desert, not camping of course, cause it's cold, I mean, Utah gets really cold, but we love to go on little adventures. So, you know, some customers have a $25,000 razor in this case, and some people like me like to go on mini adventures. Just like it deserves, this exterior is now protected and absolutely stunning. We're going to make the inside match, interior match, with CarPro Pearl. We've got a detailing brush. This detailing brush. We have a microfiber towel to level and wipe off. It's going to make this plastic look absolutely just, just awesome. 
As a way of saying thank you to my customer, I'm gonna seal the glass on the windshield with Griot's Garage's glass seal. I would of course like to take some time to thank the customer. Thank you, epic customer, for letting me detail this razor. It was fun. It was beautiful when it came in here, but of course it's leaving, uh, I think, that much better. I hope you like this video, and I hope you love the results of the detail. Thank you so much, my dear friends, for hanging out with me. It really does make me happy. Up here is a link to subscribe. Up here is a link to another video. Click it, watch it. I hope that you love it. And of course, whenever you want to detail along with B, head on down and detail that like button. We'll catch you, my friends, on the next one.